Operation Standout. Some 40 organizations and individuals gathered in Spring Hill this weekend to provide in one location every imaginable form of aid veterans might need. Over 200 veterans, men and women, came to the event, and for all, all needs were met. Stand down volunteer, Don Ottinger. What we try to do, one of the challenges that vets have is how to get to the services that they need. And if you think about, you don't have a car, and maybe even you're homeless, how are you going to get to all those locations where you may be able to get the help, whether it be um, housing, uh, addiction recovery, uh, even the VA. Uh, it's, tough to, it's tough to get in there. So the whole idea on the stand down was why have the vets try to go seek out the services they need? Why not bring the services here, bring the vets here? Basically one, one stop shopping and they can take care of everything they need. Uh, For instance, their teeth. Kathy McGartland is the director of Mission Smiles. We're a mobile dental clinic that provides free dental care throughout Hillsborough okay, County throughout the year. Free. Free. Veteran Albert Hutt had just come from his appointment in the mobile Mission Smiles office. It went great. Uh, there's hundreds of languages in the world and a smile uh, speaks them all. And here at the stand down, they're giving everybody a great smile. Marine Maurice Duff was a helicopter door gunner in Vietnam. Here is my fifth year at Sandow. First year, uh, I was homeless. They got me a place. Uh, I used that service for three months. Free, they paid my rent and stuff like that. I got a job, moved on. I could have used that service for six months, but I didn't. Uh, I just used it for the three months just to get on my feet because this here is a hand up, not a hand out. You know? So if you use the services and use them well, you can get a lot out of it. The second year I was a volunteer out here and I was the liaison between the judge and uh, the vets. That, I got the vets into the courtroom so the judge could hear cases and suspend court costs and fines. I also had $3,200 of court costs, court costs and fines eliminated myself. Okay. Well, it's, 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 a, it's a place to really help a vet. Representing Veterans Court this year was Judge Sean Crane. He says he and his colleagues are sensitive to the veterans' circumstances. Perhaps. Oh, absolutely. I think there's, the, you know, we, we need to recognize that folks that have served our country many times in combat situations, many times in situations that give rise to PTSD and other emotional type issues, we need to recognize that. We need to recognize that the, this is a unique population that deserves unique services through our court system. For Peace Vision, Bob Height reporting from Operation Stand Down in Spring Hill, Florida.